and welcome to my painting called A Raven Conspiracy. This is a 36 by 36 inch oil on canvas. And as you can see, it makes a big impact in a room, especially if you have it uh, centered kind of over a fireplace or in the central part of a living room. What I want to talk with you about today is actually a little bit of the technique and how the painting got its name and a little bit of the inspiration behind it. So the painting got its name because it is depicting a wolf who's being ganged up on by a bunch of ravens. And in the English language, a group of ravens is called a conspiracy. So hence the title. But what we see here is a Mexican gray wolf who is uh, being ganged up on, like I said, by a group of ravens. And the ravens are actually stealing a little object from him, and we'll, we'll get to that in just a minute. This was actually inspired by me and my two dogs that I no longer have. They passed on quite a while ago. But I used to keep my dogs outside while I was working in the yard, and I would notice that the ravens and the crows and the magpies would often gang up on the dogs to steal water or treats from them. If I left them with a little treat, uh, like a piece of rawhide or a chew toy or something, the ravens especially like to gang up on the dogs and tease them and steal stuff from them. So that's actually the, the genesis of this painting. We see here that the one raven is making off with a little pendant, and that pendant is the Hopi symbol of the sun. So here's the group of ravens at the bottom who are distracting the wolf while the raven up above is flying away with the prize. And this prize is a call out to the North American uh, Northwest Coast people who have a very amazing and wonderful tale uh, of, of their history of raven stealing the sun. And this pendant that you see here is the Hopi symbol of the sun. Now the background of this piece, I wanted to keep it pretty loose, but still a bit energetic and show some movement throughout the piece. And I actually used a little bit different technique there. The paint's a little bit thicker, and I used a bit of wax medium in it in order to create a little different depth and feel to the paint. So there you have it, the finish to A Raven Conspiracy. Thanks for tuning in, and if you'd like more information on this or any other painting, please see my website, nancyryansstudio.com. Thanks so much.